Hey guys, today we're going to install a vacuum can. This is from Crane Cams. The part number is 995901. We're going to install it on this beautiful 1970 Camaro. The issue we're having is uh, when you're at idle and say you press the brake a couple times, the brake stiffens up like you're running out of vacuum. So it depends on your setup. Certain cars with less, this car has 13 inches of vacuum at idle and, it, and this happens to it. Uh, I have my car is at eight inches at idle and it doesn't happen to it. So it depends on what kind of car it is, how big your brake booster is, and there's a bunch of factors in that. This issue usually happens if you put an aftermarket cam in it and you have a lot of overlap and you lose a lot of vacuum. Okay, so what you do is from the engine, you take the vacuum line going to your booster and put it straight here to this plastic valve here. And over here, the kit comes with a bunch of stuff actually here. Uh, it comes with two nuts, a pair of nuts, that you uh, can install this somewhere on the car with on these threaded rods here. And it, got, it comes with a pipe plug because it has two holes here, threaded holes. One is for a gauge, but we're not going to use a gauge in this application. We're just going to put some Teflon sealant on here and use this pipe plug to seal that. And on the other side, they give you this hose barb and an angle adapter if you want to use the angle adapter. So what, that's what we're going to do. We're going to use this setup here. And on this side, that goes straight into your vacuum booster. So you also need to buy vacuum hose. This is the vacuum hose we're using for this car. You just go to your auto parts dealer, and it's 11.30 seconds. Okay, so before we do the job, this is how we're gonna route this. You see this uh, vacuum line going to the booster over here? It goes in the back of the intake manifold. So we're gonna put our line over there, and go run it all around here, all over here, and probably go around and under there into the nose area over here. And we're gonna mount it right in there, in front of the radiator on this bracket right here. All right, we're gonna put the pipe plug in, put some thread sealant on it first, or you can use some Teflon tape. This is a 3 16 Allen on that side. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this in. And you're good. Same deal with this one. Put the white stuff on it and she'll love you for it. And you're good. Now throw it in the hose barb. And you're good. We put some double sided tape here so it doesn't rub against the bracket over there. Just sort of like a safety, little safety measure. And this is gonna go right there. Okay, so we're mounting it over here, right against the bracket. And we're good. Okay, so as you can see, this isn't going anywhere. That's nice and tight right there. So we're just gonna leave it just like that. All right, now we're removing the hose from the intake manifold. So twist and pull. And it's right off. Now we're taking off the booster. All right, so we're feeding it through. It's going through the fender here. See, it's wired through, it's uh, fed through here. And it's, it's gonna come out through that hole over there. There it is, voila. Okay, now at the end of the hose here, I'm just gonna spray a little bit of silicone spray, a little bit of lube. Makes everything better. And you're good. The other end of that, we're just gonna cut it right there. A shot of butter sauce here too. And shove it in, baby, into the plastic check valve. And that's good. Alright, now the check valve on the booster, you just take it and you twist it around. You loop that up and pop that in there. We route it in the same spot as the other one. And that's good. Okay, that side's done. Now we're gonna do the other side of this onto the can. Loop this up. 
and you're good. All right, so we're pretty much done. Now we're gonna put the grill back on and take it for a test drive. All right, so we're taking it for a test drive. And we brake, brake again, again. That's actually pretty good. Not 100% better, but it's a lot better than it was. Thanks for watching, subscribe, like and share me. See ya!